Welcome back to Bahari News Kenya. My name is Marcy Blessing. Welcome. Kills arises as Kenya Motorist Association breaks down why petrol should be at 140 Kenya shillings per litre. Kenya Association of Motorists, which has membership of 300,000, insists that the petrol should be retained at 140 Kenya shillings and not the current 211 Kenya shillings. In an exclusive with Bahari News Kenya on Wednesday, the association chairman Peter Murima stated that the state's interference in regulating the price was the main cause of the record price hike. He added that according to the prevailing barrier prices of 92 US dollars, the price per liter should only increase to 140 Kenya shillings when the tax and other overhead levies are added. Murima went on it and explained that the since the renaming of the Energy Regulatory Commission ERC to the Energy and Petroleum Regulatory Commission EPRA, states now demands an upfront payment of the taxes on the imported product, a charge that is then transferred to the consumer. Morema, when the fuel arrives, the government started subtracting at the cost before it is up off loaded because it demands that all the taxes are paid up front which forces the traders to go for loans so that they can pay for the taxes the dealers now pass that across to the retail market Murima said besides the taxes which are so high and irrational, it is possible that any country in the world can ensure that the energy is within the range of affordability, whether it is through subsidy or good management of the economy, which ensures growth in the economy. The trouble, according to Murima, began at 2000. 2019 after ERC rebranded to EFRA, which he argues, which he urges limited the authority independence. He claims that at the time, the state incredited a formula for calculating the full price agreed upon by then independent ERC. I will be coming back with more news. Keep subscribing Bahara News Kenya. My name is Marcy Blessing.